So hello and welcome guys. I'm just going to do a brief video, just a bit of a, um, a quick hobby tip for you. Um, I'm currently working on some of these which are dwarf uh, Vault Warden teams for Lord of the Rings strategy battle game. Um, and luckily I've had to buy the, the Failcast stuff from Games Workshop for these. I do have um, a few of the old metal ones which were perfect as you can see the faux spears on those are always great and if you bend a model back in the day with these metal models you can bend them back and it's so easy however with the fine cast models you do end up with these warped kind of horrid looking spears which nobody likes to see on a battlefield which is such a shame for um, such a dynamic and good game to get into um, so I've heard a lot of people talk about how to fix this I know people use certain things like hot water but I think the old idea is to try and heat the resin that you get with the fine cast to then be able to malleable, kind of well, manipulate it back into position where it should be. Um, what I've managed to come across is something that's been sat in the garage for so long. It was given to us by um, my father-in-law. Um, it's a heat gun. Um, you can pick these up from Audi and Lidl's and stuff in the middle aisles. People use hair dryers as well, so I've put the kind of the hair dryer dry nozzle on the top, and I'm just going to go through how you kind of rectify this on here. Okay. So it is a bit loud, I do apologise, but technically what you do is take it a little bit away. You can vary the heat on these as well, so it will take a bit of time to get it to the point where it will be a bit more malleable. Perfect. It's a little bit warm now, and as you can see, really bendy. And it's just a case of while it's getting to the point where it needs to be nice and cool you can then manipulate that back into place and as you can see there that's a pretty good improvement on what you had before so really simple really effective but again it might come in handy for a lot of people who are obviously frustrated with this and I mean you do get things like your fountain court guard and other types of um, Age of Sigmar stuff that was also fine cast that does have the same problem uh, but hopefully that helps you out and again it's something that you can add into your repertoire when building these models um, I hopefully will be back with some more battle reports now we're allowed to so fingers crossed there'll be some more updates for you all the best stay safe bye bye